Now that winter has arrived, homeless shelters are filling up as people look for a place to stay warm. With poverty being a constant problem across the province, organizations in Prince George are working together to help address the issue. The evidence may not always be obvious, but there are homeless in Prince George. It's also about couch surfing and the underlying issues around uh, homelessness or at risk of homelessness. So issues of poverty and being right on that line where you know you may not have enough money for food at the end of the month. Starting out as a student at Community Partners addressing homeless four years ago, Brandon Grant has now moved to president of the board. We do a homelessness action week every year where we provide resources like backpacks full of gloves and mitts. Grant says they will still see about 200 people come through October's annual Homelessness Action Week. We've got amazing people uh, doing this work every day and I'm confident because of that uh, we're going to make real progress moving forward. People needing temporary shelter in Prince George this winter will have access to an additional 30 beds through funding by the government. The extra overnight spaces are available now through the end of March when a cold weather alert is activated. It's up to the community to decide when an extreme weather alert hits and how many spaces should be available on any given night. That poverty line issue around um, you know, making sure that people are stable and have enough to eat and still have a, a quality place to call home. Grant says the next challenge for him is looking at ways to improve secondary homelessness. Mary Cranston, CKPG News.